The Navy's first littoral combat ship, USS Freedom, arrived at Joint Base Pearl Harbor Hickam. The ultra-modern U.S. Navy ship, bearing a four-color camouflage combination, including flat black, haze gray, haze white, and ocean gray, arrived at Pearl Harbor while on a deployment to the Asia-Pacific region. The ship was specially designed to be able to maneuver in areas of water difficult for many larger Navy ships. The littoral zone refers to the part of a sea, lake, or river that is close to the shore. A littoral combat ship uh, can get into those areas uh, that our blue water Navy not necessarily can, can access. From our shallow draft that we have, uh, we can operate in those close in land, not only for operations, but to engage with uh, regional navies uh, where we cannot necessarily send a destroyer cruiser into because the, the port might be too, uh, too shallow for, for those ships to go into. Fast, agile, and mission focused, LCS platforms are designed to employ modular mission packages that can be configured for three separate purposes surface warfare, mine countermeasures, or anti submarine warfare. And two MT 30 Rolls Royce gas turbines. Getting this ship out when this deployment is just important, and it is uh, really unique that it's occurring on the hills of a week that ends on the 15th of our anniversary for the 3rd Fleet and the 7th Fleet. This deployment will also capstone looking at the operational concepts, minimal manning, maintenance, and this business of rotational presence for this class of ship. Reporting from Joint Base Pearl Harbor Hickam, this is Petty Officer Daniel Barker.